नमस्कार मैं हूं डॉक्टर मनीष सिंगल मेडिकल कॉलेजिस्ट अपोलो हॉस्पिटल्स नोएडा एंड दिल्ली से बात कर रहे हैं वाई इज कैंसर इंक्रीजिंग इन इंडिया इफ यू लुक बैक एट हिस्ट्री हिस्ट्री ऑफ ऑल द डेवलप्ड कंट्रीज यू विल फाइंड दैट वेन दे वर इन द डेवलपिंग फेज देयर कैंसर इंसिडेंस वॉज एक्चुअली राइजिंग इट ओनली बिकम्स प्लेटूड वंस दे बिकम डेवलप्ड India is a is a developing country and we are passing through lot of changes in the ecosystem of the country which is also not only affecting people but also affecting the environment of the country we are struggling with lot of pollution crisis be it be air pollution be it be water pollution be it be soil pollution we are also passing through a phase where the people want to outperform each other so there is lot of stress levels there is performance anxiety and this performance anxiety in the developing country causes an increased level of stress and therefore we know that this all leads to increasing risk of cancer not only this increasing stress also leads to increasing use of tobacco increasing use of alcohol and substance abuse i think the story is very simple a developing country with people who are developing with the country pass through lot of physiological mental and also physical stress because of which the overall incidence of cancer keeps rising this has happened in various parts of the world which were developing previously and are developed now and this leads to cancer not only this during the developing phase the children get exposed to fast foods quick foods people have less time for themselves and that is how because they value profession more than their personal time and this leads to uh, the increase of of not only cancer but most of the health crisis so i think uh, the best way to beat cancer is not to take on to tobacco not to take on to alcohol do regular exercises keep your life as less stressful as possible spend time with family and friends and lead a happy life second i think it is everybody's responsibility to bring down the pollution level so don't pollute your nearby water bodies don't pollute the air in whatever capacity you can personally do and with this we can see a better india thank you